Hi, Morris fans. It's Renat Valley with you, and uh, and I'm Travis Dermott. And welcome to another uh, 20 questions. What's your middle name? My middle name is James, named after my father, and I look up to him a lot because he's a great guy. Awesome, awesome. Why do you wear uh, your jersey number? Well, I wore four growing up because of Bobby Orr, and then oh, when, I, when I went to Erie, Bobby. <laughs> when I went to Erie, I wore 44 <laughs> because four wasn't available, and then I kind of got eight given to me this year. But I mean, it's four plus four in a way. So. Rock, paper, or scissors? Rock all the way. One guy you wouldn't want to fight. Definitely you, Valley. Oh. I mean, I thought you were a nice guy at the start of the year, but that changed really quick. Oh, wow. thanks, You're pretty man, scary. I, I would never fight you too. Like, nah. Uh, what my duck's character relates most most to you? I'm not a big Mighty Ducks fan. I mean, I've seen it a couple times, but the goalie seems pretty cool. White tape or black tape, and why? I've gone back and forth this year. I don't know if you've noticed. Uh, Whenever I'm playing well with one color, I kind of stick with it. Do you secretly know all the lyrics to a Disney song and which one? No. Me either, so. <laughs> okay, go to the next one. <laughs> go to dance move. Definitely my dab. I mean, show everyone's it, show watching. It the, show it to the guy. Just, oh my god, look. Oh. Um, wow. Awesome. That's, yeah. <laughs> what Olympic sport would you medal in? I feel like the luge. I don't That'd know what that means. That'd be pretty sweet. Someone where you're right down please. and like you're going down the hill. Oh wow, that's that's crazy. That'd be man. awesome. One concert you have to see still. I really want to see Tim McGraw and Faith Hill this summer in concert. That'd be pretty cool. I know you probably don't know either of them. Oh, no idea. No <laughs> idea. Who's the most interesting roommate you've ever had? I mean, I was with Soupy a couple times. Oh, and he's, he's brutal. Absolute brutal. <laughs> he's not a normal dude. He seems like a normal guy. No. Who's most likely to take on coaching role after their playing career is over? Definitely Kirby Reichel. <laughs> this guy has a brain for the game. Oh, first car. Oh, that's a huge one. I same with Nielsen. I uh, we both got Jeep Wranglers, so uh, we're we're matching. Mine's white, his is black. So, who would be your dream line mate, D partner? You. Oh, thanks, new man. Thanks you. You're <laughs> sick. <laughs> One player does help you along the way off the ice. Probably Steve Alexi. He's my D partner and I he's just the best defenseman I've ever seen. Favorite vacation spot. Don't go away a lot for vacation, but I went to Florida for the draft when I got drafted to Toronto, so that was it was pretty fun. If you could go on a date with a celebrity, who would it be? I mean, are you considered a celebrity, Renette? Oh not at all. No. If you could trade sports with another athlete for a day, who would it be? LeBron James. Oh, LeBron. He seems like he lives a pretty cool lifestyle. Do you smile or go with a blue steel look in your head shot? When you smile. Your, smile. Smile. You got a beauty game. Show the missing tooth. I got it. It's, it's yeah. nailed. I mean. You have a pretty smile too. Thanks. Thank you so much for watching. It was uh, Travis Dermott. See you later. Bye, my friends. Ha, ha, ha.